for the common misconceptions about vaccination, I give you at least five. Okay, for the first is number one, natural immunity is better than vaccination. So when we say natural immunity, the patient or the children will get the disease itself. So what you want to prevent when you are giving vaccination is you want to prevent them from getting these complications from these serious life-threatening infections. Number two is that vaccines are ineffective. Okay, Vaccines are not ineffective because it is proven based on studies that it spared several million deaths from these vaccine-preventable diseases. So it also, they also say that vaccines can cause autism, particularly MMR. So there was one study published in 1998 which claimed that MMR is related with autism. But it was later found out that this study was seriously flawed and fraudulent. So the journal who published this retracted this study and then the medical doctor who made the study, his license was revoked. So it is important for us as pediatricians or as doctors to share reliable and trustworthy information, especially to uh, the parents of our patient. Next is, they say that too much vaccines or simultaneous vaccinations can overload the immune system. It is not true because when you eat, when you breathe, the moment you put your hands on your mouth, you expose yourself to millions of germs, viruses, bacteria, fungi. So giving simultaneous vaccines only uses a small portion of the immune system. So it won't in any way overload your immune system. Some will say also that vaccines are not safe. So in terms of safety of vaccines before being out in the market, vaccines have undergone several clinical trials and even after it is introduced in the market, Food and Drug Authority, they even do surveillance regarding the adverse effects of these vaccines.